Chelsea with Jimra here. Today we're doing a standing abs workout. You don't need any equipment at all. And you can find solace in the fact that it's gonna be tougher for me because I'm on the sand. So power through this one, it's gonna be really fun. To get started, we're just gonna be taking a step to the right, lifting up one leg then the other. So you're kicking your glute. And this is just warming us up. You can bring your hands out in front, then pulling them in. Nice. So even though this is a standing abs workout, we're really gonna be working our full body. And working on your abs when you're standing really helps to work on your posture too. Nice. Now bringing the butt kicks in, and then bringing the knees up. Now really pulling in your crunch. Again, we're just warming up here. And you'll notice that I have a special water bottle in the shot. So I've been trying to reduce my waste of plastic water bottles. Here, bring your legs wide, sink down low, hands behind your head. We're just twisting to the right, back to the center, to the left. I've been trying to reduce my waste of plastic water bottles. So I was really excited when this company, Core Plus, sent me one of their water bottles that filters tap water into good hydration drinking water. So I'm gonna leave you my honest review going to the right, then to the left, to the right, to the left, if you stay tuned until the end of this video. Right, left, last little warm up, hands behind your back, just crunch in and up, in and up. Tucking your chin down, still keeping those elbows wide. Already maybe feeling it in those glutes. For three, and two, and one. Sinking down low, just let your booty back. I'll show you from the side. So we're just pushing our booty out and then we're tucking everything back in. Pushing it out, tucking it in. This tucked action, when you're tucked under, this is what I want you to activate through this entire class. So get the feeling of letting your abs go and then tucking them in. Two more like that. Last one, nice. All right, we're leaning forward with a flat back. We're taking our left hand over to our right foot, then back up. Right hand to left foot, back up. Crunch into your abs as you twist. Nice, really pulling in your glutes as you come up. And two, and one, nice. Now we're staying low. We're just lifting up our right leg, then our left leg, and your hands can move with you. So it's a little bit of a skating action, just starting to get our heart rate up here. Going back and forth. Nice, pick up the speed. Lean low, pull in your abs. You can always have your hands at heart center. For three, and two, and one, beautiful. Feet together, we're stepping out with the left foot, lunging down low, stepping the left to meet the right. Really getting deep in that side lunge, pulling it all back in and tucking your tailbone. Beautiful. Keeping your shoulders back, try to keep your chest up. For five. And four. And three. Two. One. On this next one, we're lifting that left leg straight up in the air. So we come down into our lunge, lift straight up in the air. It's a slow and deliberate movement and we're getting into that side waist. Crunching up in those love handles. Try to balance for a breath at the top. Helps if you keep that top foot nice and flexed. For a three, two, one, nice. Hands go out to your right. Be really strong with your fingers, pointing that left toe. We're gonna pull that left knee in towards our body, kicking it back out, letting the toe touch the ground. Crunching in your belly. 
Now we're getting, instead of just getting into that side waist, we're getting into all those left obliques. Nice, can you keep it balancing for these last 10 and nine? If you lose your balance, just come back in. Six, five, four, three, two, one. So graceful. Now balancing on this right leg, we're gonna pull that left knee in, step it back. Pull it in, give a little hop off the right knee. For five, and four, three, two, one. Nice, back to those butt kicks. Whew, it's hot out here, I'm gonna take a little sip of water. <laughs> Keep going with your butt kicks. Uh, well, it does taste good. Picking it up. Now you're jogging, really kicking those heels towards your glutes. Nice, bring it to high knees. Back to butt kicks and high knees, butt kicks, good, getting that heart rate up, high knees, butt kicks, one more time, high knees, lift them high, nice, coming back to standing, this time we're stepping out with the right foot, lunging down, step the right back to the left. Really articulating through your hips here. Standing up, squeezing up and in. Oh, it's hard to work out on the beach sand, I'm telling you. But it's worth it. I hope that it's motivation for you guys. Couple more. Think about crunching down with your abs for three, two, one. All right, now we're stepping down. That water feels good. And then we're lifting up with the right leg. Lunging down with the right, straight up. Lunging down, coming up. Nice. Try to get a breath there as you balance on that left foot. And if you fall, that's still good for your abs. So don't worry about losing your balance. For three, and two, and one. Okay, we're bringing the hands out to the left. Really reach with those fingertips, pointing the right toe. We're bringing the right knee in, back out. Crunching in with your abs. Beautiful. Try to get the full expression with your chest open every time you come back up to standing. See if you can balance that right toe off the ground for the next 10. Pulling in your navel. Three, two, one. Nice, you know where we're going. Hands up to the left, pulling that right knee in and jumping off of it. Nice, nice little hop. Getting your heart rate up. Crunching your abs. Three, two, one. Good, back to the butt kicks. Whew. I need one more little sip of water here. It's a warm day in California today. Okay. Starting to run with that a little bit, getting your butt kicks in. Maybe moving your arms, high knees. And butt kicks. And high knees. 
and butt kicks. High knees and butt kicks. Beautiful, come to stillness. Hands above your head, pulling the right knee straight in, placing it back down and switching. Nice, really crunching in. Letting your heart rate come down a little bit, but still staying really engaged. Nice. Three, two, one. Bringing it to kicks. So bending up with the knee, kicking out with the foot. Whew. Back to knees. All right, we've got a power push. We're gonna jump up, pulling our knees in. So it's pull with the left, pull with the right. Keep it going. Woo. If it's too much, you can always bring your hands to heart prayer. Otherwise, pull your arms in. Four, three, two, one. Let that go. Right foot's gonna kick out, left hand coming to tap the right foot, bringing it back down. nice when the water comes to lap my feet. <laughs> nice, let that go, switching sides, right hand up, kicking the left toes, up to meet the hands and back down. Again, a nice slow movement where we're pulling in with our abs. One. All right, we're gonna kick forward, then kick back. So we kick forward with our right leg, back with our left. Hands at heart center to get your balance. Beautiful. Two more. And then maybe kicking and bouncing back to the back foot. If that's available for 10, nine, kick with a vengeance, eight, seven, six, five, using your abs to get your legs up there, four, three, two, one. Nice. Woo. Take a breather, you can butt kick it out. High knees. All right, moving on to the left side. Kicking left, kicking behind you with your right. So kick forward and back. Put some power into it. Breathing. Using your core to balance you in place. All right, keep going like that, or we're gonna jump to it. So you kick forward, jump back. Kick forward, jump back. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice, let that go. You can sway side to side, just like how we began. Beautiful. Whew. Bringing your feet together. We're leaning down into a squat here and lifting the right heel, placing it down, lift the left. Alternating, lifting your heels, trying to keep your core engaged. Everything else stays the same. Nice. 
nice. Now keeping your right heel up, little pulses. Press your hands together to lift your chest. Back to alternating. Try to stay nice and tight through your core. Left foot up, little pulses. Three, two, one. Back to the alternating heel lifts. All right, both heels up. See if you can sink a little lower. Little pulses, the shake is good, let it happen. Four, three, two, one. Heels down, lift your toes, lift your heels. Toes, heels, toes, heels. For five, and four, three, two, one. Let that go. Legs are gonna come wide. Woo. Legs are coming wide. We're gonna squat down. Put your hands behind your head. We're squatting low and taking the left elbow over to the right knee, back up. So of course this is working our glutes, but we're also getting into those side obliques and those abs as we crunch. Keeping your elbows wide. Woo. Back to center, you can inhale up. Exhale, sink back down. Hands behind your head, crossing that right elbow over to the left leg, back up. Inhale your arms up to the ceiling. Exhale them back down. Walk your feet together. We've got 20 jumping jacks. So we're coming out and in, bringing that heart rate back up. 17. 11. Woo. Five, four, three, two, one, return to those butt kicks. And the high knees. Butt kicks. And the high knees. Butt kicks. High knees. Nice, all right. We're putting our right foot out in front, left foot behind us. We're sinking down and coming back up. Only bending down in that back leg. Nice, now keep the back leg straight. Can you straighten the front leg? Bend back down. Woo! Oops, sliding into the sand here. Keep going, bending down with the front, straightening up. Now both bend down, straighten. Keeping your stomach engaged. Keep going. Now staying low in your squat, hands are coming out to the side and just swinging down by that leg. So you bring them out to the left, Swing them down to the right. Nice and slow. Keep 
Keep going. Three, two, one. Bring your feet in a little closer. We're staying bent in that back knee, pulling the left knee in, singing it back down. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice. Just a little butt kick out right there before we switch over to the other side. Woo, high knees. Pick up the speed, butt kicks. High knees. Butt kicks. High knees. One more butt kick for good measure. Nice, coming down. This time, our left leg is going forward right leg behind us. We're bending down with the right knee, straightening it out. Woo. Little movement, packs a lot of punch. Keep your core engaged. Nice, now keep the back leg straight, just straighten the front leg, bend back in. You might start to shake, I know I am. One, bending both knees down, straightening them out. What a beautiful day it is here today. Five, four, three, two, one. Staying low, hands go out to the right, Bring them across to the left. Try to stay really graceful. Woo. This water feels nice, but it's moving the sand on me. Like a dancer for three and two. And one, nice. Step that a little closer. We're bending back with the back leg, pulling it in, stepping back into a lunge. Back to our butt kicks here, run it out. Let that all go. High knees, butt kicks. High knees, Woo, shaking it out. Butt kicks, high knees. Last butt kick. Standing with your feet hip width distance. Hands are going up, we're pulling our right elbow towards our right knee. You can bring the other hand on the hip or leave it up. Really crunching in. For three and two, one. Can you leave this leg up here? We're just straightening that leg, pulling it back in. You can bring your hands onto your hips here. Four, three, two, one. Let that go. Shake it out for me. Give me some butt kicks. Really letting that all go. High knees. Butt kicks. High knees. Butt kicks. High knees. Last round of butt kicks. Nice. Then finding your feet on flat ground. Hands go up, we're bending the left knee into the left elbow, coming back down. Cr 
Crunching in with your side. For three. One. Nice. Okay. We're bringing that knee in, keeping it up there. You can have your hands on your hips, kicking that left leg out and in. If you want more challenge, you can always bring your hands overhead. For six and five, four. If you lose your balance like I did, come back in. Three, two, one. All right, let that go. Butt kicks, high knees. This is our last little cardio blast here. And then we are all done with this routine. Butt kicks, high knees. All right, we're coming down into fast feet. Bringing your hands behind you, back in front. Bring your legs wide, fast feet wide. Back together. Bring them wide, back together. Nice, last set of jumping jacks, then we're done. Woo. You did so good in this workout, keep pushing. Two, one, nice. All right, let's cool that down. Just stretching side to side. Nice, spinal rotations. Reaching your arms across, cooling down the body. Back to those nice spinal rotations. And then you can keep stretching here, doing some cat cows if you'd like. And I'm gonna give you my honest review of the Core Plus water bottle. So I received it in the mail. It's pretty easy to use. It filters your tap water into drinkable water that has antioxidants in it. It's alkaline pH, I think 9.5, better hydration. So it really hydrates your body, especially good after a workout. But I love it because if I'm stuck in the car or going around town, I can use any water to put in this and make it work for me. I'm gonna rate this bottle an A minus though, because I do wish that it was glass. I really wanted a glass water bottle. I see why they did plastic, because it's a lot lighter and easier to carry. But I hope they make a glass one. Thanks for watching, you guys. I hope that your abs are gonna be nice and sore from this video. I sincerely appreciate you coming to work out with me today on the beach. Did you guys know that we have a free app with all of these awesome workouts on it and a website to, for you to visit? All the information is in the info. Don't forget to subscribe to this video and give it a, give it a thumbs up.